Hey guys, and welcome back to Tenchu. When we last left off, we unlocked some nice new clothes. We crossed the bridge, we went into a gold mine, we did all those fun things in prior episodes. Uh, and we're starting to look pretty dapper now. I have changed our hair so it kind of gels a little bit better with our uh, outfit here. Uh, I've just noticed we've got a big bow on the back, <laughs> which is kind of funny. Um, okay, cool. Right, well, uh, I guess we should go take our Crimson Killer on another mission, shall we? Right, what's next on the old chopping block? What have we got? Still the matchlock gun designs. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I remember this mission. I'm pretty sure I do. So we've got still the matchlock gun designs. See, it says at the top there, steal the matchlock gun designs. And uh, at the bottom, it says recapture the matchlock gun blueprint. So, yeah, a lot of little weird oddities in this game. Uh, okay, then. We shall go on the mission to get these guns back. Agents report that an Okinawa uh, merchant has the designs for a powerful foreign matchlock gun. Goda is in great danger if uh, Owaga gets the designs infiltrate the castle and steal the designs before the baddies get them basically all right cool got ya i got you dude don't get lost in the castle oh shit oh shit this is probably going to be a very long mission ha uh, full of traps and all sorts of goodies so we can't can we not all right apparently we can't go up there Fair play. Ah, oh, this is a much bigger map. So we're going to have enemies at every turn. Oh, look at this place. Look at this place. I'm pretty sure this map gets reused again as well. There we go. There we go. Now, unfortunately, we're not very stealth in this red, but hey, that's fine. Right, who have we got up here? I do like the fact that you can't, if you're sneaking, you can't fall off the tower, which is cool. Right, so we've got one spear dude down there. Okay. Right, turn around. Actually, no, we want him to turn the other way. Come on, dude, turn the other way, and then I'll stick this sword in your back. I'm already on edge. Hmm. Heavily hungover. Let's do this nice and smooth. Who am I kidding? It's not going to be smooth, is it? It's probably going to go fairly poorly. This is a huge map. I am expecting shit tons of guards. But that's cool. That's fun. Alright. Let's deal with this guy. Oh, man. You know, the, uh, the sword play in this game... And just the animations and the sound effects really are rather satisfying. I'm quite the fan. Now, I don't know where the Tom... I don't know where the Tom's going to be on this level. Oh, he's right here. Well, I mean... Oh, no. That's a little bit awkward. Apparently, we can't jump up on that wall. See how deceiving that map looks. Uh, it looks like we should, in theory, be able to just jump up and over that wall, but we can't. Hey, dude. Sorry, man, but you're important to kill. I can't remember why you guys are important to kill, or, in fact, if the game ever explains why these guys are important to kill. I'm not sure. But, that's not important. The only thing that's important is this guy dies. Pretty sure there's like a whole underground to this castle as well. Sorry, dude. Good night. What did you drop for me? Yeah, these guys generally drop something interesting. I think... I think that's a black powder bomb. And that is an infinite drop into nothingness. Which is good. Because we can use those as body disposal pits. There we go. One sack of shit down the drain. Lovely. Okay. Cool. 
Come on, Crimson. Let's go mo Oh, dear. Dear, oh, dear. Didn't want to do that now, did we? All right, let's go murder. I find the lack of guards disturbing. Ah, hello. Hello, dear fellow. Yeah, it looks like the guards are out tonight. Oh, god damn it. So we've got a woman over there. I wonder if we throw them down a pit, if that counts as killing them. I'm going to say probably. Right, he's going over there. Right, let's do this guy in. Oh, lush, there's some bushes right behind us. Be beautiful. Nice. Get out of my sight, sir. Now, we don't know where... Oh, dear. We don't know where these designs are. Probably going to be in the heart of the castle somewhere. Let's get back up on that roof as well. The hell are you talking about, sir? There's no time to be discussing the finer points of rice cuisine or whatever it is you guys talk about all day. Probably alcohol, actually. Rice wine. There we go. That is what I would imagine these guards would be most interested in. Okay, I think think we should be safe here. We'll wait for that rube to walk past. Jam in the back with a knife. All quiet like. I'd forgotten about uh, how cool the customization oh there we go. Of the game actually was. There's definitely more to it than I remember. And also I think as the game goes on we just keep unlocking more and more stuff. I know like some of it's quite shit. But, you know, it's nice to have those options. These days, we'd be charged extra for that. Lovely. Now, we don't want to get that blood all over us. So. Check this building out. Alright. Yeah, I mean... The maps aren't as big as you initially think. You see them and you think, Christ. Um, this is going to be fun to explore. But they're actually not that big. So, ooh. Ooh. What's in here? What is in here? Not many enemies, to be honest. Are we playing this on hard? Actually, I don't know if... Uh, I don't exactly know what the difficulty does in this game, to be honest. Um, I guess we just take more damage. And the enemies might have more hit points. Maybe that might be pretty much the only difference. So I don't remember it really doing an awful lot of much. I know it doesn't add more enemies. At least, I don't think it adds more enemies. Right, let's get this guy and do him in over here. In this nice little bush. Out the way. Wow, they're going to have to, like, get a whole new guard detail when we're finished. Alright, what's going on in here? I hope everyone's decent in here. Be a terrible shame to. Oh, hello. I don't know if that that guy's not an innocent. Definitely not an innocent because he has weaponry. Now, how could we get around this? Hmm. There might be some good shit in here. I think when they stand up and they yawn, I might be wrong. But I think 
that's an opportunity to grab them. This guy does look important, though. Alright, wait for him to yawn. Come on, dude. Hmm. Not sure. He didn't yawn that time. Which doesn't really help us. Maybe we might just have to bum rush him. And grab him quick whilst he's startled. What do you think, Crimson? What do you reckon? Should we go for it? Or is... Oh. There we go. Beautiful. Right. Let's go take this sack of shit out with the rest. Go. Oh, no. We're going to go down a ledge, aren't we? Right, let's do them in here, then. Good night. He looks like a pretty... Uh, intimidating character, to be honest. Alright, let's go heft this baggage over here. Yep, yeah, there we go. Now, Crimson here is a lot stronger than she looks. Anything good in here? Uh, maybe not. Oh, we could have come in behind him, too. Potentially. What's that? Yeah. Not sure what those are. I need to have a good play around, to be honest, with the uh, equipment. I said that in the last video, I think, or the video before the last one. There's another one of those dudes. Yeah, the guard detail here is very, very thin on the ground. Got an enemy ninja over there. That's interesting. At least I'm pretty sure they're ninjas. Go see. Yep. Come to mama. Enemy ninja. Damn. Oof. <laughs> Don't look out the window, dude. Please. Or the big gaping door, I should say. If you can just stay over there, that would be great. Oh, all those years of training. Oh, you failure. You absolute failure. He's dropped a nice little ninja star for us as well, which is wonderful. Oh, hey, friend. You can come with me. That was close, actually. I thought somebody else noticed us. But luckily, just this guy. Looks like we can go underneath. Yeah, because I'm sure this castle has like a big underground component to it. Um, let's get rid of the stiffs. I know we shouldn't be polluting the waters, but hey. Not sure if they get noticed when they're in the water. Alright. Now, sneaky sneak, sneaky sneak, sneaky sneak. Sneaky sneak. Ooh. So this is like the armory. Somebody is around here. And the music and the atmosphere in this game really is rather bloody good. And I am quite the fan. Alright. Looks like we're clear for now. Oh, no, we're not. See that guy just pop out of the fucking woodwork. Oof. Um. Right. Can you go up against that wall, please? Thank you. Where are you going, dude? Where are you going? Is that as far as you're going? Oh, dude, come on. Seriously? Ooh! Ooh! He faked me out. You see that? You clever bastard. This guy... 
gets a little bit more respect. Not much, but a little bit more. This is a much more competent guard. For sure. Oof, that was sketchy as. Okay. Hopefully, we are nicely thinning the herd out. Who are you? You are also armed. Okay. Okay. We can handle that. Their vision range isn't that impressive either, to be fair. Come to mama. There we go. Come on. Let's go find you a nice little quiet bush to die in. Come on, buddy. Yeah, um... Ah, I'm curious about the difficulty of this game, because... Ooh, there's a spider or something on the floor there. And we missed the special kill, but it doesn't matter. Um, Crimson, what was that about? Right, okay. Get this baggage hefted down. Yeah, there's a spear guy over there as well. All right, thanks to our heightened senses. But is that the only spear guy? That meddlesome woman again. Come on. God, yeah. Come with me. Let's go put another body in that river. <laughs> well, I mean, I guess it's a moat, really, but hey. Yeah, I'm starting to remember how just overpowered you are in this game really when you think about it uh, i'm sure the game gets significantly harder later on but at the moment jeez louise big papa cheese all right let's do you in here so satisfying they really did make the the stealth kills in this game so unbelievably satisfying all right you can get in there what is that Oh, it's just a uh, grass texture, apparently. Right, let's get up high. Now, I'm guessing what we want is going to be in one of these buildings. Maybe. I mean, there's the main castle there. So I guess, really, we probably don't have to worry about those buildings. To be honest. There's probably going to be ninjas. Oh, there's a horse over there. There's almost definitely ninjas in this castle. Right. Hold on to your ass. We're going in. So we have a spear guy. Ah, okay. So there's no way for enemy guards to come through the other side. It's curious. Alright, let's just pop in down behind this chap. Um, that went about as bad as it could have gone. To be honest. Didn't want to hang off the ledge there. Just wanted to roll down. But hey. That's the way it goes sometimes. Hopefully that guy's not too spooked. Hey horse. That's a fine looking horse. Okay. Let's try that again. Yeah, I, that that went about as, <laughs> as horribly as it could have gone. I love it. I love the way this dude is just standing there now. He's just like, yeah, just going to stand here. Absolutely no shit's given. Nothing bad's going to happen to me tonight. No. All right, let's get rid of him. Dickhead that actually spotted us. Ah. <sighs> 
We've got like three spears on us as well. Do we even need to hide the body? Um, maybe. I don't know. Go stick him in this bush over here. Right, you got to be careful of ninjas. I thought ninjas were more dangerous in this game than that. Hmm, very curious. Very, very, very curious. They seem to be uh, a simple one-hit kill. I'm sure there's an enemy in this game. Oh, I might be thinking of another game that um, has a chance of... Oh, Ooh, dear. Has a chance of actually um, countering your grab, I think. Could be wrong. And I love the fact that we can just look around the corners like this. Is it cheap? Yes. But the game allows us to do it. Alright. Come on, dude. Turn around. Turn around. And something good might happen. Well, he's turned around. But he's not the one we want to turn around. Dude, you're turning the wrong way. Or can you smell my perfume? Might need to think of a different tactic for you. Because we need you gone. Because you're kind of... Ah, you dickhead. Now you turn the way we wanted you. Hopefully we can wait and he'll swing around again. Uh, we could just go to the roof, I guess, but... The good stuff is inside. Oh, he's tired. There we go. Okay. That potentially could have been iffy, but... We just about played that off. I think enemies can see through windows in this game as well. Which is something to be very, very aware of. Okay. Now, what's going on inside here? I think... The next target probably... Should be the guy doing laps. Because he's going to be problematic. That guy would be quite easy to get, but I don't know when the lapper is going to come back round. Come on. Come on, dude. Um, I suppose. Here he comes. Here he comes. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, that's nice. Thank you. Thanks for that, chap. Missed the special kill, but that's fine. Yeah, happy with that. Right, let's move him out of here. Because no doubt... Ha! He didn't even see me. Yeah, no doubt there's going to be more patrolling guards in there. Oh, you would expect there to be more patrolling guards in there. But who knows? How hidden is this? Uh, it's kind of hidden, I guess. Right. You. You're next. Hear a lot of people upstairs. Which is concerning. Right, let's keep stacking bodies outside. Come on, my friend. Come on. Let's take you for a walk. And go uh, rest next to your friend Reno's here. Oop. Oh, she really does stick that sword in, doesn't she? Oh, she's savage. Right, okay. Who's next? Who is next? That big room only have one guy in there? I mean, I guess. Okay. Now, unfortunately, uh, that indicator 
although it's telling us how close enemies are, um, it doesn't tell you whether they're above or below you. Which is a potential problem. Ah. Have a female ninja. Right, what we want to do with her... Get the blade out. And I wonder if she's going to walk past the... Uh, paper wall here. That would be amazing if she did. She's very close. Come on, love. Come on. I think she's wandered off again. We might be able to leave her in there, to be honest. So what exactly does she... Oh, that's not a she. Because you don't really want to get into a fight with a ninja if you can help it. Not if we can help it. But that is going to make it significantly easier to see what he's doing. Right. Beautiful. Got you, son. Come to mama. That's two ninjas down. Bit of a risky gamble there, but it paid off. Okay. Oh, did you not drop a ninja star for us? You suck. Okay. I was hoping... Yeah, so if you took the underground path, this is the way up from there. So I guess now... So this leads straight into the castle. <laughs> Which is obviously quite nice. Right, so we've got you... Oh, really? That was really unfortunate. Yeah, this guy, this guy hurts. Okay. Run! <laughs> this guy is a bit of a savage. Yeah, those guys hurt way more. Actually. Get some health back. Dude, he almost had us. So freaking close, man. That's cool. For some reason, she didn't grab, which is a little bit awkward. But, you know, there are bits of jank like that with this game sometimes. It's generally not too bad, but every now and again... Oh, I think that is a female ninja. Okay. I thought that was. That's good. Because that means everyone up here we can kill. I thought it might be a um, an innocent, as this game calls them, but I guess not so. Got ya. Got you, you little shit stain. There we go. That's what I think about you. Get the fuck out of here. All these guns, man. Now, where is she? I know she comes out. I'm guessing that's where the pr uh, the plans are. Um, move. Thank you. Yeah, she's in there. But where? There she is. Right, come here, love. Terrible bit of 
business about to happen, but... Well... There's no friends in war, I'm afraid. Come on, there we go. Now, does she give us anything? Oh yeah, she does. Nice. Cool. Now, this castle's pretty well protected, as you'd imagine it would be, in all fairness. Because, uh, uh, it, well... Okay. <laughs> it's a castle. So that makes sense. So we've got a couple of big boys down there. Oh. Right. That's a little bit more delicate. Oh, I think they're the plans. Nice. Oh, okay, we didn't even have to fight those. Kind of would have enjoyed fighting those guys. I like the way she does her victory dance, but she's not out of the castle yet. That was a long, spicy mission. Hey, Ninja 5. Nice. 18 kills. Quite a few. Chokehold. Total SK. Alright, happy with that. So there we go. So, I mean, look, we've just like made free grand back. You can purchase new items, you say. Hmm, what new items are those? Let's go have a little look, shall we? That was a fun mission, actually. And that's the thing with this game. This game is a lot of fun. Uh, it really is. Okay, so, items. What's new? Grenades. Oh, blinding. Throw at an enemy to inflict temporary blindness. That doesn't sound too bad, actually. Because if you can blind them and then run up and stab them, that sounds quite good. Ah, paralyze unconscious or sleeping enemies. Interesting. Okay. So that, ah, that's a smoke bomb. So what's that then? Oh, that's a blinding powder. Yeah. So, stink. Ah, the, okay. So, we can actually lure enemies around with these. Um, pinwheel. Throw at an enemy, then press left stick to explode. That's interesting. Don't remember those. Deadly thrown weapon. When we can start buying these. Oof. Nice. It's going to be It's going to be good. We've got plenty of healing items. We've got purifying. We've got some antidotes. Paralyze. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Cool. We will probably start using. Uh, probably start using um, items later on. Maybe. I don't know. As long as we get our Ninja Five rating, it doesn't matter. And one thing I like about this game is because it's kind of done on points, and the point system is very generous. You ah, let's go check. Did I do that on hard? You can actually like have a lot of fun in the missions and use weapons and use items and use you know everything at your disposal and still get the best rank, which is cool. Uh, yeah, we have done that. Yeah, so everything so far has been done on hard. Cool. I might. I'm gonna go back and get that Ninja Five. That gather information. I'll go do that a little bit later on. I'll do that off camera though. Uh, and then when we come back, we've got Stray Dog Sling, which oof. Sounds pretty, pretty nasty. So, anyway guys, thank you very much for watching. And as always, until next time.